Scott Long, great American. And man, am I making you guys money. If you've been paying attention last two weeks, seven out of nine with push. That's 78%. If you're only losing 22% of the time, life is good for you. My best bet this week has to do with Purdue last week. Great win. Coach Walters faces his former boss, Bielema. He knew the system. Hudson Card exploited a bad Illinois pass defense. They won easily. This week they go on the road. First big game as coach in the Big Ten on the road. You go to Kinnick and you're only a two-point dog? Come on. Hawkeyes, best defense against the pass probably in America. Love that matchup. Take the Hawkeyes. Last week... My best bet was Oregon State on a Friday night. I got another Friday night game. Hurry up and get on this one right now. Illinois, I've told you, they're trash. They're playing Nebraska. Not great, but getting better. Coach Rule making some uh, changes. And Nebraska loves to lose by three points or less. It's three and a half they're getting. Go with the Huskers as a dog. NFL, but doing really well. Biggest game of the year so far, I would have to say. Niners, Cowboys. I thought this spread would be like six or seven. When I see the Niners are only a four-point favorite at home, yes, I know. Dak Prescott, he's great against bad teams. He goes on the road, though, against a good team. I don't know if I've ever seen him win a game like that. Love the Niners. Probably my best betting system for the NFL is if Mike Tomlin is a home dog, you got to go with him. I don't care how bad his team was. Hammer saw this last year. I was constantly hammering the Steelers and telling them to sprinkle even on the money line. You got a situation this week. The Ravens, four-point favorites in Pittsburgh. I know Pittsburgh doesn't look good. And the Ravens look like they need a big bounce back. But four? Mm, take the Steelers. Finally, the luckiest team of last year is the unluckiest. That's the Vikings. And then you look at the Chiefs, who've probably been the luckiest team this year. Both teams face each other. Chiefs going in to the uh, Minnesota, the Skull. Vikings have to win this game or at least keep it close. They're getting four as a home dog. I know Swift is probably going to be. Taylor's going to be in that suite. But, hey, Hawkinfuss is probably the best tight end in this game today. And I'll also share, I bet he's got Katy Perry probably in his suite. You got to fight fire with fire. Go with the Vikings. Let's go three and two. Hey, what do we say? Four and one or five and oh, let's keep this train running.